Hello and welcome to another episode of Interactive Biology TV, where we're making biology fun. My name is Leslie Samuel, and in this video, I'm going to talk about the extrinsic back muscle innervations. Uh, so let's get right into it. The first extrinsic back muscles, the, the superficial extrinsic back muscle, the first one would be the trapezius muscle and you can see that right here in both of these pictures okay so you can see trapezius here and you can see uh, trapezius on both sides here and that is the only muscle that's not innervated by a nerve from the brachial plexus that's actually innervated by the accessory the accessory nerve which is a cranial nerve cranial nerve number 11 all right so the innervation for trapezius is cranial nerve number 11 the accessory nerve the other superficial extrinsic muscle as we've looked at before is latissimus dorsi and latissimus dorsi is actually innervated by the thoracodorsal nerve and you can see that nerve coming off right here, coming off the posterior cord, the thoracodorsal nerve, and it's coming off right there between the upper and the lower subscapular nerve. All right, so the innervation for latissim latissimus dorsi is the thoracodorsal nerve coming off the, post the posterior cord. And just by the name of it, thoraco, it's going to the thoracic region, dorsal, latissimus dorsi, uh, it just makes sense. That's one of the easier ones to remember. Then let's go to the deep extrinsic muscles, and those deep extrinsic muscles would be levator scapulae, as you see over here to the left, rhomboid minor, and rhomboid major. And these are all innervated by the same nerve, and you can see that nerve here. That would be the dorsal scapular nerve, the dorsal scapular nerve. And what happens is that comes off of the C5 root, and then that goes through middle scalene muscle, the middle scalene muscle, and then goes back to innervate uh, levator scapulae. It goes through levator scapulae and then goes down to rhomboid minor and rhomboid major. So those are the extrinsic back muscles let's review that really quick as usual you can turn the sound down and then quiz yourself uh, the trapezius muscle is innervated by c the cn 11 cranial nerve 11 which is the accessory nerve then we have latissimus dorsi which is innervated by the thoracodorsal nerve coming off the posterior cord between upper and lower subscap then we have levator scapulae rhomboid minor and rhomboid major which are all innervated by the dorsal scapular nerve which comes off of the c5 root so that's pretty much it for this video. If you're enjoying these videos, make sure to click on the like button right below if you're on YouTube and also click on the subscribe button so that you can be notified whenever we have a new video. Most of all, make sure to visit the website at interactive-biology.com. You're gonna get more biology videos and other resources to help make biology fun. That's it for this video. This is Leslie Samuel and I'll see you in the next one.